Hi ladies, hi everybody. Right, so um I thought I'd come and show you a part I've had a, received a parcel today. I'm just getting the bits and pieces off my desk. I've just received a parcel today. I haven't had time to film it, so that's why I'm filming it now. I can't show you this is the parcel. I can't show you the French box as it has my address on and the lady who sent it to me. Now this has come from um the uh, friend of mine, uh, Melba, she's a very talented lady and I've seen some of her work on groups on Facebook and it's just something to be wowed by. So um, the we had a bookmark challenge which we had to make a bookmark and send it to each other. So this is what this is. So I've opened, I've literally just, you know, open the box so i wouldn't be all day trying to open it and she's filled it full of goodies oh melba my love right so i'm going to take the tag off first of all i think this is a die cut just yeah it is the die cut oh wow look how pretty that says i think that says something but i don't know what See, I don't, am I reading the right way? No, I am reading in the right way. I don't know what that says. I don't know what that says. But it says something. I'm sure Melba will be able to tell me what it says. Oh, let, let it, let it go. That's what it says, let it go. See the L there now, let it go. Well, thank you, Melba, for that. That's gorgeous. I'll be using that in my crafting for sure. Right, so she sent... Go oh, my days. This tag's gorgeous, Melba. It's... It's... Wow. <laughs> I don't know where to begin. It's um, raised. I don't know what this says behind it. I don't know what she's used. Can you hear that? I don't know whether it's the type of glue she's used, Mod Podge, I don't know. But she's raised it and then she's put this beautiful fairy image on top in black. And it's a gorgeous tag. And then on the back, she's used now these images I recognise from the graphic new graphic 45 book. I haven't got it myself, but Angie Paisy was showing me her book. Um and she was telling me how the amazing pictures in there. So that's where I recognise them from. That, that is a gorgeous tag. Oh, I love that fairy. And it's all raised. I don't know what that is behind it. Wonder, it's all like texture, which I love. I absolutely love my tag. Thank you so much, Melba. So she's put this in. Which again is graphic 45 and she's made an envelope now. Oh, do I have to rip it to get oh yeah I've got it. Oh. I hope I opened it the right way. To a special lady for all you do, all these things was made by me with love in my heart and joy of beginning being a part of a special group. Oh bless. The bookmark challenge is in here and an extra one and an extra one. Embellishment goodies challenge done by me. I hope you enjoy. They are not perfect, but they were done with love and enjoy. Well, I am sure I'm going to love it. I mean, I love the fact you've made an envelope out with the paper. What a good idea. And I love all these um, flowers here. And I'm wondering whether it would be okay if I took the flowers off and I could use them in my projects. And these. I love it. And, of course, I'm going to love everything that you've made me because it's made by you. And that was the idea. So, oh my days, so I'll open this one, so this one, I've got, she said these embellishments are butterflies, I love butterflies, absolutely adore butterflies, so you've been watching, she's sent me butterflies, and she sent me some gorgeous tags which I love and ephemera, so this one is like 
an English lily, I think they call that one, L lily of some sort. Hard restores. That's that's a really nice one. Oh, I love flowers of any kind and lilies and thirteen and eleven. I love all this. I haven't got nothing like this at all, Melba. So it'll be perfect to put in my projects. Thank you so much. This one's like a bingo card. Oh, I feel a junk journal coming on. Oh, I could use it in the junk journals that um Shirley and Chaz made for me. Oh. I knew I was going to drop them. I am dropped them on the floor. I'm just going to place them on top. While I see the rest of them. I love these. They're quite thick as well. I don't know where the Melba's printed them out. They're quite thick cards. I love them. 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 I adore these butterflies. And the butterflies you've cut. So I'm going to move that to one side. Um, oh god, I don't know what bit to open first. The bookmark challenge. You wrapped everything so perfectly. All oh, right, so let me open this. I don't think this is the bookmark challenge. I think these are the embellishments she's made. Oh wow, what an idea how to make you know oh, this. This is um, rubber matting. This is that rubber matting. What a good idea to make to make flowers out of this. So I'm going to untie that and I'll use the ribbon. Let me open this up. Oh, look at that flower. Oh, my days. Look at that flower. That flower is just gorgeous. I love it. I wonder how you've made that. You've definitely put glitter on it. And you've definitely painted it. I just love it. And I love these. I love the fact you've made flowers out of these. What a good idea to make flowers out of these. So I've got rubber matting, but I've never thought to make flowers out of them. And they're so textured. And I suppose with this, you can change the colour of them if I wanted to. I love them. I love the little centres. You've made a little tiny one. And you've made that one. And you've made the one I've got in my hand. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you so much, Melba. I'm going to try and put the stuff... Put the product, put the things, so the stuff, put the things. I know you can see my wire, my phone's trying to charge at the same time on the table as I open them. So, this one has had this gorgeous ribbon wrapped around it, so I'll keep the ribbon. Let me open this. Oh my days, did you make these? You you've made these i've seen some your, your work when you've made these these you've made these i don't know about i know she's made that one but i don't know about that one i don't know whether she made that one but she's definitely made these because i've seen something similar in it, like um in another group look at them i love that one i love the colors in this one Donny Moore. I wonder how you've made these. Oh, Melba, I love the. Oh, look at the back. Oh, I love these. I'm definitely going to use these in my projects. I'm going to have to think where to use them because I definitely want to use them on something special. You've made these. I don't know whether she's made this one or that little gold one, but she's definitely made these three. So I've seen her work before on another group where she's made something similar, but on a canvas scale. I'm going to move these to one side too because I don't want to... I love these. I, I'm, I'm blown away. Love that one. And there's colours. I don't know whether you guys can pick it up, but there's colours in each of the windows. Let me camera focus. You see the colours? It's yellow, green, yellow, green, just at the bottom. Looking where my finger is. You see? That's perfect. I'm, I'm in love. And I haven't got to the bookmarks yet. Oh, and I think this one slipped out too. Oh, look. Look at that one. She's made that one too. Oh, with a little guitar. I love the image. I wonder how you've made these. 
Oh, I'm intrigued now, Mel, but you got me intrigued. I love these. I'm, I'm in love. I'm in love. I'm in love. Right, okay. I'm going to pull... I'm just going to pull these couple of things that are loose in the box. Oh, wow. That's like a... Um, like a, it's like a badge, but it's not. It's got like a silhouette in the in the centre. I wonder if she's done that or clay. Oh, Melba, you're so talented. You should definitely be on YouTube. Honestly, now. Your work is like one of a kind. I am so privileged to have made me these embellishments to use in my project. I love these. I love these embellishments you've used. I'm going to move the camera so you can see everything I'm putting down on the table. Right, so there's this one. And then we undo. Definitely reuse the ribbon too. And am I right in thinking these are the napkins I sent you? Because they look ever so familiar. Oh, look, she's made a flower of the napkin. Look at that one. That's so clever. <gasps> wow! Oh my dear! I'm so excited! Right, I'm going to move these across. Right, so she's made. See how she's dyed the colour? Remember me saying you could dye the colour? She's dyed the colour. And um, she's made some little ones. I love these, Melba. Do you know what, right? I've just I've just put my handmade flowers in a box. Now I'm gonna have to find a bigger box for these to go in. Uh, they are gonna be used. Oh, I love the small delicate ones. They're just beautiful. They look like um um little rosebuds. That's what they look like to me. I'm gonna put these on here like so you guys can see this yeah just checking you can see there's another little one. Oh, she's made this one out of fabric and she's put a button in the middle of that one it's just gorgeous remove this napkin so there's that one but I mean come on I have never seen flowers that that's like um, a canvasy material, but it's not what they call that. I can't forget what they call it, but that's the rubber matting. I like these the idea of making flowers out of the, the rubber matting. I don't want to cover these in gorgeous embellishments, but I, neither do I want to cover the gorgeous, beautiful flowers you've made. Oh, Melba, they are gorgeous. Right. She says, bookmark challenge. I think I skipped ahead to the bookmark challenge. Well, but I think this hasn't fallen off, has it? Or was it tied between the um, ribbon? I'm just going to move that flower over there a sec. Did you make this? It looks as if you've made this. And I think I've got an idea how you've done that. And that is clever. If I think, I think you've... I think you've used wood glue and nail polish to make that. Let me know if I'm wrong. Look at that. I wish my camera would focus, guys. There, that's better. And she's all twined it and underneath. I think it was tucked where the ribbon is. I'm going to undo the ribbon. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, Melba, look at this. She's made two, so wait a sec. She's just caught, baby. I didn't want to pull it. Oh, wow, look at that. <gasps> Melba, that's gorgeous. Right, I'm going to, I'm going to, because both of them are just as equally as gorgeous, but I'm going to show you what's on them so there's a little teapot on them there's a little diamante that she's hooked on and it's hooked on with those bracelet clasps that's what they're called she's put another diamante here she's gorgeous lace she's backed it with and then what she's done she's created a stick pin all 
all the way down and then she's twined it through the lace she's put beads and bows and all all different sorts on there and then i um, put a diamond on there and then on the back there's a piece of ribbon and that ribbon then holds um, a diamond and then on the bottom she's made one of these and she's put a heart charm there one of the bracelet charms and that that is that is something to be wowed at and that that is just gorgeous i am in love for that that is absolutely stunningly gorgeous i am totally in love with it i love the fact you've done like a little pink heart i'm in love i'm in love right i'm gonna put that there and then i'm gonna show you the second one so it was only required to make one but melba made two oh it feels like denim did you embroider this oh melba this is gorgeous i love this it reminds me of um gypsy gypsy wagons that's what it reminds me of oh wow i love it i love that's what it reminds me of gypsy wagons i wonder if you've embroidered all this all the embroidery and then all the tassels at the bottom to go with the trim the coordinated trim and it's even got leaves on the back i'm in love i am totally in love with my bookmarks but i'm not finished yet she's sent an, a ladybird napkin for me to play about with oh there's something in here in here oh there's a little fairy here Oh, Melba, I've got a fairy from Mississippi. I am going to keep and treasure and hold her. And, yeah, she has come all the way from Miss Mississippi, America. And I'm going to keep hold of her. She's going to stay on my desk with this that Shirley gave me this little house and she's going to stay on my desk with that little house to watch over my work I love her I absolutely love her and then at the bottom there's something in here so the box is now empty so I'm going to move the box oh let me see what's in here wow oh is what I think it is oh Melba did pull it in case I'm pulling too hard. How on earth did you do that? That looks an image of a napkin. How on earth did you manage to do that? Oh, Melba, look at that. That's just gorgeous. Feels like it's got Mod Podge, but how the heck did you manage to do that without it sticking to the napkin? And then in here, I'm going to move these, um, they're like, um, wax paper. In here, there's another one. This one's filed. Oh, look. That's what it looks like on the back, and that's what it looks like on the front, and that's all filed. That's gorgeous. And then there's another one in there. I think I can see another one. And there's that one. So she's made me three, which I'm going to absolutely. I'm actually going to put them between the layers of, you know, the layers that you've just given me so they don't stick together. Um, I don't know how on earth you've managed to do that. They're obviously off napkins how on earth you've got them to stick without them sticking to napkins i'm just going to move that way guys because i know you can see it in soft pudding um i don't know they're just gorgeous now but they're just absolutely stunningly gorgeous i love the foiled image i am blown away by how much you've sent to me you shouldn't have sent this much bookmark would have been completely fine honestly but I love my goodies. I truly do. I love my two bookmarks. And I love all the handmade embellishments you've sent me. 
and all I'm hiding all the butterflies and stuff underneath. Let me just get them so you can see them while I speak. All the butterflies, and I'm going to use everything you've sent to me. When I find a home for a oh, there's another one there. Look, I didn't even see that one. Um, I'm going to find a home for for everything that you've sent. And I love these flowers. I'm I'm in just I'm in love with them. Oh, I do. I love these little ones. They remind me of rosebuds, like I say. So let me know if it's okay to take your flower off this envelope because I'd love to reuse it. And if I can take your flowers off and reuse them, then I will in my projects and the things off. I love the tag that you've made and the die cut you've put in with says let it go. And then all these beautiful ribbons that you've given me, they will not go to waste because I'll be using them in my project. And I'm going to raise you up and I'm going to put that fairy just on the top where you can see her. And I'm going to say thank you so much Melba. I am absolutely in love with my goodies. I love everything you've sent. And these, I'm just blown away of how you've made them. I am definitely going to use these and the heart one. Look at the heart one guys. Probably can't go in clap. We've seen it. We've seen it. Well, thank you so much, Malba. I'm gonna message you now. You know you've received the passage today. Um, like I say, I'm gonna message you now and I am going to um love and leave you all. I will be back, guys, to finish the Tilda doll. I know I haven't been on to do the Tilda doll, but I'm hoping tomorrow I'm gonna sit down and do um some sessions on the Tilda doll with you. Because I think it's just been over a couple of a week now, maybe less than a week, and I don't want to leave it too long, because otherwise you'll get bored of doing the project like I do. So no, I will do the Tilda doll with you. In fact, I'm doing making another one for another lady, so I will do the Tilda doll with you, and um, keep a lookout because there is a challenge coming up on my YouTube challenge, which I'm about to tell everybody. Um, now in a second what that all is about so i will see you all on the next video take care bye for now guys thank you so much melba and thank you ladies and gents for watching bye